Okay, well, a new comedy series debuts today. It's called The Canoe Project, and uh, two of its stars... Actually, you know what? I got it right here. Mark Harnett, who... Oh, he's the series creator and comedian. And then we have Jimmy McKinley. Yes, uh, it says an actor. It, is we, that all it says? That, that yeah. all, that's, oh, all, that's all it too. says and there. Actor. Yeah. And, 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 well, they have a and, comma there, too, so that's, that's <laughs> good. There's punctuation is more in my title than... Do <laughs> you want to add anything else to that? You can, uh, you're no, here that's, now. that's pretty, yeah. Okay. Uh, it's very early in the morning, too, so this is the, I don't think I've ever been up uh, this early. Well, yeah, yeah it's like actors, comedians. And I'm jet so. yeah. Oh, right. Okay, so where, where are you guys coming from? Where are you from? Uh, I'm originally from Miramichi, New Brunswick, and okay. I'm coming from Miramichi, New Brunswick. Okay, so huge been, viewership in, in Miramichi, New Brunswick. So you want to say hello to anybody? Do. Yeah, I just yeah. Uh, I want to prove to my mother that I'm uh, actually in the television business. <laughs> <Right> <laughs> Way to go. She didn't believe me till right now. <laughs> until right so now. There you yeah. go. You got it, Mom. Uh, yeah. And Mark, where are you from? I'm from Newfoundland. I grew up in a small town called uh, Comfort Cove. Okay. But I moved to St. John's when about 92, 92, I guess. 92, okay. So, so I've been in there for a while. Where'd you come up with the idea for the Canoe Project? The Canoe Project came from uh, my little brain. I, uh, <laughs> I, uh, from my experiences, <laughs> little brain. when I moved from uh, from You're small town. You're on TV, you should, say, you should say big brain. <laughs> big brain. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, I, I came up with the idea from moving from a small town to a big city, like St. John's when I was 18. It was the first time I moved away from, from home and having to adjust to a big city coming from a little small town where there's always hunting and fishing and you know being on a four by four or whatever and you go in St. John's and it's just overwhelming so I decided to write take put an indigenous perspective to it so I created the fictional town of Char Harbor Labrador and I bring my native culture to town and Mr. Jimmy whose name is Richard in the show he wants to make a documentary it's actually a mockumentary but he wants he wants to document my settling into the uh, to the what? But that's that's why we're, that's yeah. why it's coming out today too, because yes. it's National Day of Truth and Reconciliation. So that's kind of what ties into your background. It does, it does, and it just shows that you know, despite a lot of hardships and a lot of tragedy, we can find comedy in it. And it's, you know, it's just we chose this day because you know you just wanted to the, to have a laugh yeah. and for people not to take everything too serious. Right. How do you know this guy? I've never met him before in my life. I have no idea. Hitchhiking. Uh, they picked me up on the guy. It worked out. <laughs> you gave, me a, gave, him, you gave him a job. And he's an, and he's an actor the, now. Picked him up on the gardener on the way here. We've known. Would you, nice to meet you. We've, uh, Mark and I have known each other since 2014. So uh, I was living in Fredericton, New Brunswick, and started out uh, doing some stand up comedy between there and St. John. And he hasn't uh, stopped following no. me around since. So we're pretty good friends. Yeah, now, cool. and we, do we a did lot a of few shows, shows together. together yeah. yeah, more than a few. We bounced, we, we bounced a lot of stuff. We off try, each other. yeah, and what we've tried mm -hmm. to do is try to put our own personal experiences, like you know, having hotel trouble or or uh, yeah. into the show. Right. So yeah, uh, it, the, the character's not based on me, the, who, who I play. Is it based on him? It's not. No, <laughs> it's totally <laughs> opposite <laughs> him. Yeah, actually. Okay, okay. Please don't cancel me. Okay? <laughs> Please don't yeah. cancel me. <laughs> Uh, how, many, how many do we make? How many do we have? Six episodes. So there's six episodes, mm -hmm. and how long are they? 10, 15 minutes. Oh, 10, 15 minutes. Okay. Yep. And so, so it comes out today, and where can, where can, people, where can people find it? They can, uh, it's literally channel one if you have the Bell, uh, okay. Bell yeah. 5 TV. So okay. if you have the Bell channels, uh, it's literally channel one. Uh, dial in the Canoe Project, right. and you can watch all six episodes, I believe, today. Okay. Today. Uh, mm -hmm. If we don't have Bell, will they be up on YouTube or something at it's some point? It's a good time to switch to Bell. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're here on behalf of Bell, are you? Yeah, I know, yeah. <laughs> this is going to be a blue here in a minute. Well, listen, congratulations, guys. That's, that's, that's pretty exciting. What is your What is your mom's name, Jimmy? <laughs> Nancy. Nancy. Well, let's, let's see. Nancy. Jimmy made it. <laughs> ah, he's on CHCH Morning Live. Look at you now, well, Jimmy. Well, Got to go. Much. Way Thank to go. Way to go, yeah. Mark. Nice, nice, nice meeting you guys. Meeting you guys. Uh, cheers. The Canoe Project debuting today on this uh, Canada's National Day for Truth and Reconciliation, where, as Mark says, we can, uh, we can have a laugh, too.